Hello viewers, welcome back to the second part series of Technical Universities in Ghana and I would like to urge you to subscribe to the channel because this is the best university inquiry YouTube channel which keeps you well informed. So in today's video, we are going to take a look at the whole Technical University and the origin of the whole Technical University goes back to 1968 it was established as a technical institute with a primary objective of providing pre-technical education. So by the year 1972, the institute had made tremendous progress in upgrading of the courses offered. And consequently, the pre-technical programs gave way to courses in the engineering and vocational fields. The main mission of whole technical university is to train highly competent human resource to the highest level possible through career-focused education, skill training, and research in partnership with stakeholders. So let's take a look at the general entry requirements for higher national diploma programs at the whole technical university. SSC holders must have six passes A to D in all subjects including English language and mathematics and at least three of the passes must be relevant to the area of specialization. WASI holders must have six passes A1 to D7 in all subjects including English language and mathematics and must possess a minimum of a D7 in any three of the passes relevant to the area of specialization. Diploma in Business Studies holders must have four SSC or WASI credits including English Language and Mathematics plus at least three DBS passes in relevant courses. GBCE holders must have five credits including English Language, Business Mathematics and Integrated Science or Social Studies. Technician Part 2 and 3 holders must have four SSE or WASI credits including English Language and Mathematics. Technician school certificate holders must also have passes in English language, mathematics, integrated science, plus any three relevant trade courses. Mature applicants must be at least 25 years old by the time of application and must pass a written aptitude test which includes English language, mathematics, and general paper in the relevant area. Moving on with the general entry requirements for Bachelor of Technology programs at the whole Technical University. So the general admission requirements for SSC holders to Bachelor of Technology programs are credit passes A to D in six subjects comprising three core subjects including English language, mathematics plus three elective subjects relevant to the area of study. WASI applicants must have credit passes A1 to C6 in six subjects comprising three core subjects including English language, mathematics, plus three relevant subjects to the area of study. General Certificate of Education advanced level candidates must have three subjects at least one of the passes should be a grade D or better. Also, the applicant must have credit passes B6 in five GCE ordinary level subjects including English language, mathematics, and subjects relevant to the area of study. Higher National Diploma candidates must also have graduated with a good HND certificate with at least a second class lower division. Mature applicants must be at least 25 years old and show proof of age with birth certificate or any legitimate document to prove their date of birth which is at least five years old at the time of application. The applicant must pass a mature entrance exams conducted by the university, which includes English language, mathematics, and a general aptitude test. Let's quickly take a look at this important announcement at the whole technical university. And you are to purchase the whole technical university admissions e-voucher from Zenith Bank, Ghana Commercial Bank, or any of the post offices nationwide. You can also purchase the e-voucher alternatively by dialing star 713 star 34 star 1 hash on any network to buy the e-voucher and pay with your mobile money. Fill the payment platform form and select the mobile money type from the payment options. 
Click Submit, then an SMS or an email containing your e-voucher details, which includes your serial number and PIN, will be sent to you. In addition, the e-voucher details will also be displayed on the admissions login page. Application Procedure Log on to the official website of Ho Technical University, that is http app.htu.edu.dh slash admissions and follow the instructions on the page to apply. You are also required to enter your serial number as well as your PIN number when you visit the online admission system page. Follow the steps of the online admission system to complete your application. Enclose in an EMS envelope a printed copy of your completed online application together with photocopies of certificates or resource slip. Transcripts for top up Bachelor of Technology applicants and certificates for matured applicants. Post the enclosed EMS envelope to the following address below. The Registrar, O Technical University, O Volta Region, Ghana. Application Deadlines Kindly revert to the official website of Ho Technical University for any updates with regards to dates for applications and submissions of forms. Using the Mozilla Firefox search engine, we are going to search for Ho Technical University. And the official website of the Ho Technical University is htu.edu.gh. So it takes us directly to the official homepage and it's even advertising for the 2021-2022 admissions. So those who are interested in applying to Ho Technical University can do so by purchasing their e-voucher and the procedures I have stated in my earlier slide. There is also information on the student's portal as well as schedule of fees and how to contact the university with regards to all inquiries. There is also information on the four mainstream programs which is being run at Ho Technical University and there is the Master of Technology programs the Bachelor of Technology programs, Higher National Diploma programs, and non-tertiary. So please take your time to maneuver your way through the university website. So now my focus is on admissions. So I go to admissions and I go to how to apply. So this is basically the application procedure, that is if you are interested in Ho Technical University, you follow this procedure in purchasing their e-voucher and visiting their online application systems to apply. There is also information for international applicants and international applicants may be admitted on the basis of qualifications from their countries for which equivalences shall be determined by the National Accreditation Board of Ghana and submitted to Ho Technical University. Evidence of English proficiency is also required for these applicants who are from non-English speaking countries. And it also talks about international applicants being required to purchase a non-citizen's Ghana card as a prerequisite for admissions. And there is also contact information in case you need any further inquiries. So under the admissions tab, there is HND admissions, there is postgraduate admissions, there is check admission status, there is undergraduate admissions, and there is undergraduate programs. So please take time and go through all these categories step by step and know exactly what program you are interested in applying to the whole technical university. So upon satisfaction, please click on the apply now column so that you begin your application. So let's take a look at the HND programs available for science and technology at the whole technical. And there is the HND in agricultural engineering, 
HND Mechanical Engineering Automotive and Production Options, HND Building Technology, HND Civil Engineering, HND Electrical Electronic Engineering, HND Hotel Catering and Institutional Management, HND Food Technology, HND Statistics, HND Agro Enterprise Development. HND Computer Science and HND Information Communication Technology. Moving on to the High National Diploma programs under Business and Arts, there is HND Accountancy, HND Marketing, HND Secretaryship and Management Studies, HND Banking and Finance, HND Purchasing and Supply. HND Industrial Arts and the options are Graphic Design, Ceramics, Painting, Textiles and Sculpture and HND Fashion Design and Textiles. So we move on to the Bachelor of Technology programs which institutes Engineering, Sciences and Technology and there is the Bachelor of Technology Automobile Engineering, Bachelor of Technology Agriculture Engineering, Bachelor of Technology Building Technology, Bachelor of Technology Civil Engineering, Bachelor of Technology Electrical and Electronic Engineering, Bachelor of Technology Agricultural and Environmental Engineering, Bachelor of Technology Automobile Engineering, Bachelor of Technology Building Technology, Bachelor of Technology Fashion Design and Textiles, Bachelor of Technology Food Technology and Bachelor of Technology Information and Communication Technology. Moving on with the Bachelor of Technology programs under the Arts, Business and Design School, we have the Bachelor of Procurement and Supply Chain Management, Bachelor of Secretaryship and Management Studies, Bachelor of Marketing and Information Technology, Bachelor of Marketing and Information Technology, Bachelor of Technology, Hospitality and Tourism Management, Bachelor of Technology, Hospitality Management, Bachelor of Technology, Tourism, Leisure and Event Management, Bachelor of Technology, Tourism, Leisure and Event Management, Bachelor of Technology, Food Technology, Bachelor of Technology, Information and Communication Technology, and the Bachelor of Technology, Fashion Design and Textiles. Admissions Enquiries So for all your admissions enquiries, you are to contact the following numbers that is 036-299-0146-024-034-4779 and 020-842319. You can also contact the Public Affairs Office on 024-501-0240 and 055-057-1099. You can equally send an email to the university and their email address is admissions at htu.edu.gh and also info at htu.edu.gh. So I'd like to thank you for watching, please subscribe for future videos, like this video, comment, ask questions, share to friends and relatives who are applying this year and most importantly, click on the notification bell for any new updates and I'll see you in the next video.